Hello guys, so, ngayon ito yung continuation ng uh, sinold natin ng, ng unang example So, balikan lang natin, ito yung close uh, cell classification system Dito, then ito yung cell parameters, then ito yung example na sinold natin Pero hanggang uh, dito lang yung pinampute ko muna So, pagpatuloy natin yung pagcompute ng part na to So, kung hindi ka nakahabol, tignan mo lang yung video na yun, ha? So, ayan, no? kukumpute na natin kung ano yung value ng D10, D30, D60, C, and CC. So, nung last time na compute na natin to, so yung issue na lang natin, ano yung mga diameter. Okay? So, pag-solve nung diameter, ganito lang, na. No? Okay? So, nahin ko muna ang pag-compute yung D60. Okay. So, solving for D60, so since this is, di ba, diameter, diameter corresponding to 60% passing. So, balikan natin yung table, titignan natin kung may 60% passing dito. So, yung problema wala eh, no? Wala tayong makitang 60% passing. So, yung meron lang tayong makita is yung in-between ng 62 at 50.8. So, probably andito yung 60%, no? Kaya yung gagawin natin is mag interpolate tayo. So, kukunin lang natin yung yung ito sila. Di ba? Bakit? So, probably, andito yung 60% passing or finer. No? In between yung 62 at 50. So, yan yung ilalagay natin ngayon sa calculator. Okay? So, punta ka lang dun sa calculator mo. That is, dutin mo lang yung mode. Then, 3. Dutin mo yung mode. 3. Then, pindutin mo yung 4. So, yan yung next. 3 is stat no? Okay, mode 3 Then 4, then stat Okay, so kung ibang calculator gamit mo Titignan, hanapin mo lang yung stat Then hanapin mo yung LNX okay. So yun na, so meron siyang X Tsaka meron siyang Y So yung X that represents The diameter, well yung Y that represents the percent Finer, bakit kaya? No? Kasi kung babalikan natin yung soil parameters, makikita natin na yung X must be the diameter while yung Y must be the percent finer. Bawal magkabaliktad. Klaro? Once magbaliktad mo yan, mali yan. No? Alam ko mali na yan. Okay? So, yun na. No? So, ilalagay lang natin to sa calculator natin. So, we will have 0.074 Then we will have 62. Then we will have 0.040. And we will have 50.8. Okay. So next is easy. So masasol natin yung D60 by ano yung key nyan sa calculator. Tignan ko muna ha. Yung calculator ako. Okay. So meron tayong 60. So type lang natin yung 60. Sixty x hat. Sixty x hat. Yen yen na. 
So we will have yung x at and then yan sa shift shift 1 Ay, nga pala. Kailangan ko pala mag-start eh. So, let's say meron tayong 4 0 0.074 Uh, lagi ko muna sa calculator guys ha 0.04 and then 62 and then I have 50.8 okay so easy na yan type natin yung 60 and shift 1 shift 1 Uh, shift 5 5 pala guys na. Sorry. shift 5 then 4 uh, medyo nakakalimutan ko na yun guys ha? shift 5 4 dating mariyado ko na eh. so we have 0.0663 So, yun na yung value ng D60. Okay? Klaro? Uh, later, ipagita ko din yung paano yung sa calculator. Baka hindi kayo nakahabal. No? Pero pagita ko, ipagita ko muna kung yung convention. Uh, yung by ano lang muna. Ha? Yung ganito lang muna. Mag, uh, magbigay din ako ng separate na video for ano, may makita yung calculator nyo para makasunod talaga yung iba. Okay. Next natin ko compute in is yung value ng D30. Okay. So solving for D30. Okay. So ganun pa rin. Yung mode, uh, pili natin yung stat. Then yung 4 is LNX. So we have X which represents the diameter. Well, yung y, the 3%, percent, the percent finer. Okay. So, balikan natin yung table. Titignan natin kung saan uh, dito yung D30. Okay. So, probably ito yan. Huh? In between ng 34.3 tsaka 29. No? Probably andyan yung 30% finer, no? Kasi in between siya ng 34 at 30. 34.3 at 29. So, yan yung ilalagay natin ngayon sa calculator. So, input lang natin yan. So, we will have uh, 0.010 and then this is 34.3 ano nga yan? Okay. We have 0.006 29 So, okay na yan, no? So, easy na, ulit Easy So, masasolve na natin yung D30 by 30x hat no? So, yung x hat that is shift 5 4 equal. Okay. So, type lang natin yung 30 and shift 1.5 shift ah, Okay. Okay. Dito pala kanina guys. Tama pala. Shift 1.5 So, ganun din dito. Shift 1 uh, Shift 1 Then 5 Regression Stat Regression uh, Then 4 And then yung x hat Then equal So, yung sagot nito is We have 0.0066 mm. Okay? So, yan na yung sagot for D30. And for D10, 
So solving for D10. So yung D10 is probably uh, in between siya. Ah, oh, hindi siya in between. No? Sa baba siya ng sa baba siya ng 29 tsaka 23. So yung kukunin na lang natin is yung ito. So interpolate na lang natin yung 10% final niya. So yun yung ilalagay natin ngayon sa So, yun yung ilalagay natin. So, ganun pa rin. Uh, mode 3, that is that. Then, we have 4, that is L and X. We have X, which represents the diameter. And we have Y, that represents the percent. Fine. So, lagay lang natin yung values. We will have... Zero point zero zero six thirty nine. Chaka. Okay. Zero point zero zero two twenty three. Good. Then easy na. So we will have now the D then that is then X hat, where X hat is shift. Mo lang type mo lang yung 10 then shift 1 5 4 equal ok yun na so we will have 0 0.000185 mm so yun Hmm, okay. So next nating ko compute in is ano yung value ng ng CU chaka CC. Okay. So CU is just D60 over D10. So therefore this is 0 0.0663 all over 0. Point, right? Okay, tatlong 0. 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 1, 8, 5. So, thus we have 358.38 and for CC we have D30 squared out of D60 times the D10. So, there, therefore, this is 0 0.0066 squared all over 0 0.0663 times oh, D10. Ito yan. 3185. Therefore, this is 3.55 So, ito naman yung sagot niya. So, so far, nasolve na natin lahat yung tanang. So, I think that's it. No? So, bigay lang ako ng uh, sa pang example. No? So, yun na guys. Thank you for listening.